Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna draw a big one sheep, so let's get started. Um, first we're gonna wanna just draw, we're gonna start in the middle of our paper and just draw like a curved line, just like that. And then we're gonna draw a U. And then we're gonna come up. And do like a V at the top. So we have this. And then we'll keep going up like there. And draw a U. So we're just gonna draw a U. <coughs> and then U on the other side. And if I'm always going to if I'm going too fast, uh, pause the video. Um, uh, so now, uh, we can, we'll draw a big U like this, or like a curved line, and then draw a line, and another U, like, sideways U. I know it doesn't look like much right now, but it, it will, once we're done. And then we'll draw another U for his other ear, and then a U coming back the other way. Then we'll draw a line coming down. And, um, then we'll go start from the top and go over and then. Kind of like a sideways S. Draw it on both. Just like that. And then come back in and just like connect it kind of into the ear. So it looks like that, and then we'll draw the, let's draw with some small, slightly curved lines on his horns. For a big horn sheep. Now, We'll draw in, we'll change a slight small U right here, and a line up, and a small heart shape right in the middle. It's, uh, it's kind of like a heart for his nose. And then, uh, now we're gonna draw the inside of his ears. So we're gonna draw just some Zaggy lines for hair and ears. Uh, now we're gonna draw his eye. We're gonna do a curved line, just like that, and draw a U, and another U inside, and a dot, just like that. And You'll barely see his eyes for sure to do it a little line. And uh, for her chest, we're just going to draw a V kind of. Then we're going to kind of draw his cheekbone. We're just going to draw us a U. Then for his head, we're just going to draw some lines for her. Just like that. Then we're gonna keep coming down and then take it and then draw a flat line and come back up for his leg and then a straight line come back. 
down and up. And then starts and then we're gonna come back on his back and stomach. Then we'll draw a a curve like this on the back and then then draw a flat line come back up and connect it to his back so we have this then I have to draw his other leg so draw the same thing with his other legs so we have that then we'll draw a line on each of these for his hook. So, and then um, we can draw some lines coming up from his arms right here for like and then Draw a line right here and here for like a shoulder bone. And then we have to make it so we can, he's not floating, so we have to draw some ground underneath his hook. So let's just draw. If you want a grassy thing, I want to do it rocky because bighorn sheep kind of, um, they more live on like rocky mountains and stuff. But you can, but, uh, some, a rocky, you can, I'm drawing mine on a rocky hillside. Okay, um, now if you're wanting to draw mountains be behind him, uh, if you're wanting to draw mountains behind him, uh, you can draw, you can do this, you draw like some rocky mountains. I like to dip down and then draw like another one. Like this to give them some depth because like that looks like that one's in front then draw like a smaller mountain range it's not as jagged behind it or in front of it and then like draw some detail on the mountains then this could be like a valley down here where there's like cactuses Draw like draw cactuses. Get some valley down here. Grab. Maybe like spiny cactus. and um i think that's it um so thanks for watching and i hope you've enjoyed this video and uh, and uh see you uh Excellent. Bye.